Good day, Sacramento, and welcome back. This is so exciting. The extremely detailed look of the Beast in the California Musical Theater's production of Beauty and the Beast really comes to life by an extraordinary team. And this morning, it is so exciting. We are joined by the designer who is able to make this process happen and Beast himself, who is a local guy. So I want to introduce to you James Snyder. Come on over and Nicole Cellelli. So we're Hello. actually watching um, some video from the production itself. Um, and James, first, I want to start with you. Local guy, graduated from yeah. Christian's bro Christian Brothers. Yeah, yeah. Born uh, and raised in Rancho Marietta, and then uh, moved to LA, and then now New York. And, and a um, few film, TV, and Broadway credits mm -hmm. under your belt. Just got off stage with uh, acting opposite of Adina Mazel. Yeah. Uh, incredible. Yeah. Really wonderful. And Nicole, uh, Nicole yeah. Chalili, uh, the very first female winner of Sci Fi's Face Off competition Woo! back in 2012. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Raise the roof to that. Way to go. You also have a shop over there in Roseville yes, where you guys Mrs. do Vanny everything Vicks. makeup yeah. and prosthetics. And and it just we do beauty it. makeup too. We do it all. Like, um, yeah, we can we can build pretty much anything now. And, so. and speaking of building anything, really, I mean, she transformed James. And at first, it was taking two hours at a time. Yeah. And then you got it down to a, an hour, but mm -hmm. we're like forty-five you? minutes. You got it down to forty-five minutes. It's, it's a minutes. four-hour makeup. I just want to say this is a four-hour makeup. It should take a lot longer, Look but now it's, it's actually this. forty-five minutes. I love the entire transformation, Nicole. Your real challenge was he needed to be able to emote. He needed to be able yes. to really express himself on stage. So you couldn't have him, you know, being all stiff. Right. Yeah. So I sculpted this prosthetic. Uh, um, around like his facial features and making sure that certain areas were thin enough other areas I could go a little thicker but um, if you see him on stage you can really tell that he he's able to move his face make emotions he can raise his eyebrows he can give you sympathy sympathy feelings you can be scared of him look at um, that transformation yeah. And, yeah. James I mean really you do have to you go through a total transformation not just physically but emotionally as well yeah <laughs> yeah. yeah I mean it, it's it's true it's I was a little nervous because I wasn't sure what it would mask, what it was going to look like, and then it, getting to sort of let that do the work. And in rehearsals, when it's just me trying to be a beast, and then all of a sudden I, I, I have all of this stuff on, so much of that, yeah. the scary thing, when I'm like, am I scary right now? And then I look <laughs> in the mirror, I'm like, oh, yeah. Oh, I'm yeah. Scary. And, and even, that's the purpose <laughs> of it. You yeah. know, it's a, it's if a... I'm just sitting around, like, sometimes I'm just sitting around thinking about, like, oh, what, what should I have for dinner? But I'm wearing the makeup. Oh. People are like, why are you so angry right now? <laughs> like, I just, I was thinking about Jack's Urban Eats. See, that, know, sorry. See, you, you, you know yeah. you're a local guy when you bring up Jack's Urban Eats. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's, that's what happens when you're hangry. You just yeah. transform and the horns come right out. <laughs> yeah. um, what is that like for you being on stage wearing all of this? And, and are you able to reveal anything about the transformation at the end? Uh, I don't think I'm going to, I'm not, this is Disney magic happening, people. <laughs> okay, this okay. is magic. Is We've magic. worked really hard to make the I'm illusion. I'm a part of the magic, be, and it's, it's, yeah. it's difficult, but we do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, it's, it's just great, it's great to be back home, and like my parents and grandparents came to this show last night. Oh, it's I just, love it. It's great to be able to do what I love and then bring it back to my hometown. Okay, so were your kids able to see you on stage? As yeah, my son's coming uh, tomorrow oh, and perfect. Sunday, and they've already seen some rehearsals, but they haven't seen me in the makeup yet, although okay. I face you FaceTime them, them. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So yeah. He's, I'm like, doing his okay. makeup and he's like, look at <laughs> hey, it's all right. I'm a beast. Are you scared, okay. my son Oliver? I'm like, are you going to be okay? Is this all right? And, and how like, old is Oliver? He's four. He's four. Okay, yeah. so it's okay for kids as young as four. Uh, absolutely, oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. yeah. yeah. I mean, at the end great... of the day, it's Beauty and the Beast, too. Right. So as, yeah. as scary as the makeup is, by, by the time you know, his humanity comes through, really, like... He has moments, though, where he's cute. It's oh, like a does. little smile. It's so he sweet. He does. Yeah. It's and so sweet. You feel yeah. like, oh, my God, that's the Beast. It is and, the Beast. And the, and the way that, that Nicole's painted the mask, even, it, it, yeah. it evokes the, the cartoon. It the, did. The, the, the he Disney does, like, cartoon. this little smile thing, and it looks just like oh, the, yeah. the cartoon. I think it's cute. Well, you guys are fabulous. I loved the show, and you have just... A few days left to catch it. It wraps up on yeah. Sunday. So, yeah. uh, Marianne, I'll send it back to you. And Check well done, out. you guys. Congratulations. Thank, Thank you. you. All right, thanks. And watch for that. Only run through the second.